So, Carl, if you had to go to a new planet, don't worry about starting life again. They've got sort of like these breeder clones that do all that. But you can choose six people from this world to take to start this whole new world, okay? So you need, you know... As I say, you don't need to. So worry what's about happening here? Is this is this? It's going to be wiped out. Okay, it's going to be wiped out. But there's enough on this spaceship for you and five other people. Okay, and they've got them there. They've got these. They've got these sort of breeder clones there. So it's going to be populated. You're going to have the workers, the drones, everything like that. But you want to take six, I suppose, sort of um, uh, world lords to teach, to lay down the politics, the 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 teachings, the laws. The government. Okay. Um, and how long have I got to make a decision on it? Uh, till the end of this podcast. Right, go. Who do you take? Who's the first person you take and why? Uh, and where, where are we going? We, Mars. <sighs> okay, so a, a planet where there's a, 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 an atmosphere. I've got to know and, where I'm going because I've got uh, to sell it to the people who I'm asking. There's no point when okay, I go, are you coming with it's, me, where are you going? I don't know. It's <laughs> just like this world. There's there's oxygen, there's seas, there's rivers, there's forests, there's animals, okay? But we're going to populate it with uh, the human race and you can choose six people to lord over this new uh, kingdom. You want the best people for the job. Yeah. So who, who's the first person? Probably, um, Patrick Moore. Why? <laughs> why? Why would you take Patrick Moore? Just because he he knows knows his way about up there, doesn't he? He'll know the way. So just just have him. I think that will whoever I pick next. If they see that he's going, they'll go right. You know, it's going to be a long Moore's journey. As it is. You don't want someone who's going to be going. Is it left here? Is it right? Or, or, do you know what I mean? And he could play the xylophone on the journey. But, but is a, Carl, uh, is more the most useful person to have if you've only got six? Because he may be very useful getting to the planet. No, but, but I've once always you've wanted got there, to meet him as well. I've always wanted a chat, and that'd be a good chance, wouldn't it, when I'm in a rocket? How long is it taking to get to Mars? I don't know, a, a year. That's what I mean. No, it's so. not Mars, it's somewhere else. Okay, so it's a year to get there, and then... Yeah, well, that's what I mean. So it's a good chance to have a chat with him uh, okay. about stuff. Um, so much and more. I think he'd be up for it as well, to be honest. Yeah. Um, I think, I think you know... Well, why, do you, why do you think that? Just because he's spent his whole life talking about what's going on up there, isn't it? And yet he's never been, and I feel sorry for him. You know, most people, when, they, when they're when they into something, they get to go to a place, don't they? Sure. Uh, people uh, who don't know who Patrick Moore is, he's um, an 80-year-old uh, <laughs> astronomer. astronomer. Yeah, that's what I mean, so let him have, on. A, have a bit of a good life. So Moore's on board? Yeah, Patrick Moore, he's he's on. Right, out five others. Four others now. Uh, Jamie Oliver? <laughs> why Why would you take Jamie Oliver? <laughs> just food and that. You just thought you need someone, because they say that, like, you uh, you know, you can feel down if you don't eat. Um, he couldn't convince eight-year-olds to eat a carrot. What's he going to do in this brave new world? They're all going to be on turkey twizzlers. I think he's he's got the right attitude. He wouldn't be faffing about. Remember, <laughs> we've we've landed now on this new world. Yeah. I don't know what it's like. The people who listen, made I me love go. Jamie Oliver. I think he's great, yeah. but he wouldn't be in my five people to start a new world. That's all I'm saying. Nor would Patrick Moore because well, he knew the way. <laughs> well, what chef would you pick? I wouldn't pick a chef. Why would I pick a chef? Because you want someone who's going to, like I say, food's important. When you're low, there's nothing better. If you are a bit fed up, there's nothing better than having a good. But Carl, I don't think you've quite grasped that these people have to start civilization again. They have to yeah. be wise, wise people who can make the laws. Yeah. And Keep before you do all that, you need a good meal. So th Jamie Oliver, he'll be that's his job. It's like when we get there, that's when he kicks in. Right. right He's okay. the first one really Can I suggest gets going. Up? Just to save two places on Patrick Moore and Jamie Oliver, take a map and a cookbook. <laughs> okay, who's number three? What sort of state is this world in? Does it need Oh, it's gonna take a fucking gardener. Yeah. It's it's like the it's uh, It's the world but new. It's the it's that exactly. It's the world, but new, untouched by humans. There's there've been no fossil fuels burnt, no machinery, no wars, just this Garden of Eden. And you, Patrick Moore, and Jamie <laughs> Oliver pitch up. <laughs> Plus, who else? Carl, go now. First thought. Attenborough. <laughs> oh God. 
again, he's a genius, and he's a, you know he's a, he's a bit of a hero of mine. But I don't know if we need Attenborough. Just because I reckon if it's a new world, you're saying it's the same, but they always say, don't they, that all worlds are different. So I'd want him there just to sort of, when we're roaming around, because we'll all stick together for a bit, won't we? Mm. Uh, mm. When we're roaming around... Then they'll be sick of the sight of you. Uh, they go, let's lose Carl. But you've got two men so far who've got a combined age of about 150. <laughs> I mean, if you're starting a brave new world, they're... Dare I say it, not going to be around very long. Shouldn't you be taking some younger, fresher blood? No, not really, because they haven't lived, have they? These have lived, and they'll, they, they can so And they're useful, like I say. Patrick Moore's done his bit, he's got us there. Uh, Oliver has cooked us a dinner. Day two, I reckon we'd end that on day one there. We'd have a dinner, we'd all have a chat. I don't think you're thinking of the future. I it's think like you're thinking trip, it's it's only, I think you're thinking of the journey, and then the first night. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Okay, okay. So, so you've got David two. Attenborough, yeah. you've got Patrick Moore, you've got Jamie, <laughs> you've got two other places. I get the feeling that you're not so much recruiting people for a new world as I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. <laughs> uh, as a dinner party with <laughs> yeah. people you'd like to meet that you've seen on the telly. <laughs> oh. Uh, Come on, in two more. I'd text someone who's a bit daft. So. No, you don't need to, Carl. That's covered, believe us. Yeah, no, believe no, that's what I mean, though. I don't want them having to go at me going, why are you here? I'd put a, point the attention somewhere else to text someone else who'd sort of wind them up. So Who's I'm, that, then? Paul Denan or someone <laughs> like that. <laughs> it really is. I'm a celebrity. <laughs> so you've got, you've got Patrick Moore, you've got David Attenborough, you've got Jamie Oliver and Paul Denan. <laughs> And they're, and starting, new world. they're starting life again. <laughs> okay, then. Brilliant. Oh, God. Right, one more. This is amazing. This is a, it's going to be... I'd love to go back and visit this in a thousand years, what teachings they laid down. Oh, God. Don't know. It'd have to be uh, a woman, I think. You've got to have a woman in that little group, haven't you? It's... Could have another another woman chef or <laughs> it's a, chef. It's mainly eating. It's it's mainly. Chef. Oh, he's God. got that covered with Oliver, but no, I no, he's got it. to take Nigella in case he's in a <laughs> cream cake kind of mood. Oh God! Oh God! Delia Smith was furious. She packed her bags and everything. <laughs> or a nurse. Now you're thinking, Abby Titmus. 